Hey everybody, my name is John Capobianco and what I'm looking at and working on and what I'm going to demonstrate is intent-based, test-driven network automation using PyATS, REST connector, REST conf, and the Yang models, both the open config and the native iOS XE. So here's what the plan is for this demo. First, we're going to test if all of the configured interfaces on these devices have been defined in our intent and pass or fail. Now, because I want a single source of truth, my YAML intent file, which is an extension of my test bed, I'm not going to remediate. I'm just going to fail it and say, there's an interface on here that's not defined in your intent. Maybe somebody SSH'd in at the CLI and added it manually as opposed to adding it to the intent. And that's in this direction. Get the interfaces and test them against our intended configs. The next test, which we will remediate, is test that all defined interfaces in the YAML file are actually configured. Now, if it fails, go ahead and patch using restconf yang, patch in that missing interface into the running config. Then we can follow up with per interface items. And I've started with, let's say, description, but just, you know, keep an open mind. This could be IP address. This could be anything we declare as intent. So per interface, does the description on the interface match the intent? If not, put the description. Now in the case of this failure up above, it's just patching in the interface, not the full configuration. This follow-up test will fail and then remediate and add the description. So let's run the code in a couple of different directions. First of all, let's just do, let's just do, <laughs> sorry about that. Let's just do the first directional test. And what we're gonna do is we're going to add an interface on the device directly that is not in our intent. So let's get sharing the screen. And what you can see here is, if I do a show IP interface brief, it has loopback 0, 100, 200. Now, if I go into my intent on this particular device, it has loopback 0 and 100, but no 200. So someone has added that in manually. So let's run the code and let's get that first failure scenario. And I'll try to stop it once it fails. So there should be a failure in here. I didn't see it actually fail. Right here. Well, there's one. Here's the failure I'm looking for right here, right? Loopback 200 has failed device has configured interface not in the intent YAML model. So let's go ahead and add that to our intent, right? Where I just say loop back 200 and we'll give it a description of dynamically added description because I don't believe there's a description on that show run int lo 200 there is no description so now that first test is going to pass but then it's going to dynamically update the description on that interface and we'll find that test in a second so now you can see here that it passed right 200 passed because and it's right past reason device has all intended interfaces in the yaml model configured and if we go down further we're going to see here that the description test failed it has this in intent but it doesn't actually have a configuration 
we see the differential because I am updating that description dynamically added description and there's my retesting and you can see that I've added that description and let's do the more interesting use case of the device doesn't have any of these interfaces configured so let's know them out no int lo0 100 200 show IP in brief and we can see that it only has the physical interfaces so now my other direction should fail the test report those three interfaces are missing from the running config from our intent patch them in we can see it happening right now give us the diff retest so let's let this finish and then it will follow up and add the descriptions for each of those interfaces right and then there's my test results for everything so if we look up here here is my first test case failing right here loopback 0 failed loopback 100 failed loopback 200 failed device has intended interfaces in YAML intent not in configuration you can see I patch in each of those interfaces. I do my differential and you can see that I've added two loopbacks, name zero, name 100, name 200, retested, and now they all pass. And then when we get to our description section, it's going to fail. Here's the intended descriptions for each of those interfaces. They don't match. Here's my diff because I've patched them in and then here is my new descriptions so now if we go back on the device and show IP interface brief here are my three loopbacks and if I show run int lo0 it has the description of two has the description has the description pretty cool stuff and if I launch my log viewer ITS logs view and go to my latest test oh something's running on that is it running so here is my tests so you can see here intended config on interface these three tests failed so then we update and we patch them in we retest and now they all passed similar to the descriptions down here um, that's input errors where's my description disk router one description right here right here are my three interfaces that I've patched in without a description and then I remediate them and patch in the descriptions now this is Jinja free. There is no Jinja 2 templates in here. This is purely my intent, my YAML file, which extends my test bed, and PyATS test code. So let's quickly look at some of the code. And we're first going to look at the first use case. So the first use case says, right here configured interfaces in intent so I set up a little flag dictionary I set up my table data and I say for interface and value in the yang model dot items for the key and the in the actual value configured interface equals the actual interface and the key name giving me loop back zero and if, um, if configured interface is in my intent dictionary, then pass the test. Now let's look at the other one. For intended interfaces, 
So what I'm doing at first is setting up a list of all of those configuration and I'm appending each interface. I'm setting up a missing interfaces list and for intended interface in my intent, if the intended interface is in this list from the Yang model, then pass it, else fail it. And if I fail it, then I remediate it. And I'm setting up my interface type, my interface number using a little bit of regular expression. I set up my JSON payload, which is going to be in the Yang native model under interface, the interface type, gigabit or loopback or whatever, and then the name, which is the number of the interface, and I patch it in to native interface. And then I retest it. So there's no Jinja2 involved here. I'm using the Yang model and RESTConf. So this is pretty cool. This is item potent. And it is using, um, again, the combination of PyTS REST connector and the RESTConf Yang models. Now this could be anything. This could be the IP address. This could be the VRF forwarding. It could be anything, anything we want. Declare it in intent in YAML and then let the automation take care of the configuration and the testing. We're not at the CLI. We're not in Postman. Strictly Pythonic network automation using a test driven approach and using our intent from YAML. The code is available. Let me show you the repository where you can find this. And I've just called it Bubo, which is the, um, if you're a fan of mythology, that's the little mechanical owl, the first automated owl in Clash of the Titans. And it explains where you can get the sandboxes. I'm going to fix this code. So this sandbox here under CML, this one here, and let me change this link. You can reserve this sandbox and it will work with the two iOS XE devices, or you can use the other link, which takes you to the always on sandbox. So it works with three iOS XE devices, this always on sandbox, as well as the uh, CML devices. So thanks again for tuning in. We'll see you soon. And uh, I've done live streams on my YouTube channel. All the development of this code is available as live streams. I just wanted to short a, shoot a short focused video on this intent using RESTConf and Yang approach. All right, we'll see you soon.